Hello everyone, this is going to be a quick tutorial about how to 3D scan your face for making custom fitted slim to face or flip to face. It's going to be made with a Kinect V2, but you can also do this with an iPhone, but I'm not gonna explore this, this video. This is just going to be about the process on a Kinect on a Windows PC. So first you're gonna need, well, a Windows PC, Windows 10 or 11. You're going to need a Kinect V2 and a Kinect to PC adapter. I have my Kinect here mounted as main webcam, mounted at eye level or slightly above, about a meter away from the face where you're gonna be standing. As for the software, you're gonna need Kinect for Windows Runtime to use the Kinect on Windows. You're gonna need the 3D Scan app from the Windows Store. All the links are gonna be in the description. Optionally, you're gonna need the 3D Builder app to preview the scan. Okay, so open the 3D Scan app, which I have open already. This is the UI. You're gonna set the depth to the minimum because you don't want to be scanning the room itself. You just want to be scanning your face. Set the width just a bit larger than your face. Like this is good enough. I just want to exclude my microphone and set the height. That's good enough. So for the process of the 3D Scan, first you're gonna take off your glasses. You're gonna take off your headphones, anything that might interfere with the scan itself. For the process itself, you're gonna have to have your mouse over the scan button all the time because you're gonna have your eyes closed. Why do you close your eyes during the scan? Because any 3D scanning method has a hard time with scanning dark objects and reflective objects. Your eyes is both of those things. It is dark and reflective, so it makes it really hard to get the geometry right. So just closing your eyes, you're scanning your eyelids. Yes, it offsets the geometry a little bit with the thickness of your eyelid but you get a much better quality scan. Mouse over the, the scan button, you're gonna need to rest your face, no weird expression and whatnot. You're gonna need to close your eyes, not talk ideally but I'm going to talk to explain what to do. So close your eyes, press the scan button, turn your head left, then right, then up, then down, back to center, and press the scan button again. Now you have the option to open in 3D Builder. This is allowing you to preview the scan to see if it successfully got the features of your face. This is good enough. Good details around the forehead, sides, and the nose, and the cheeks. Also, with your eyes closed, as you can see, your eyelids have a nice shape that is rounded outwards. If you were to have your eyes open during the scan, it would make a small hole right where your iris would be. This would make it really inaccurate to work with the scan afterward. Okay, so that's good enough. Now you save the file, .3mf, and that's it.